Hi, it is time for October favorites. And I can't believe October went as fast as it did, but it did. And it always does, which makes me so mad because it's my favorite month of the entire year. Um, I'm still trying to get over this, whatever it is I have or had, whatever. And so I apologize if I sound kind of, you know, different. <laughs> so let's talk about the things that I did, wore, and enjoyed throughout this last month. And they are my favorites. Let's go. Okay, first of all, I wanna tell you about this coat, and it comes in three colors. And I, I mean, it's a favorite because I've tried it on and I love it and I'm excited to wear it. However, it hasn't really been cold enough for me to wear it, but I will the moment I can. And I wanted you to know about it first thing because it's on sale. It's like 30 to 35% off right now, and it's a good one. So here it is. I will show you some shots in here somewhere, but the idea of it is it's a, a kind of a funnel neck pea coat. Kind of a short funnel neck pea coat. I really, really like it. It fits so well. It's beautiful. Make sure though that you look at their size chart for this company because seriously, you have to make sure, like if you're normally a medium, don't buy the medium. You have to look and see that their medium is a whole different number system than what you're probably used to. Yeah, I learned that the hard way. Um, it is lined. It is just, and it's, it's like 30 something dollars right now, guys. I'm not kidding. And I also know that it comes in olive and this kind of a light camel color. So cute, love it on. I love it open. I love it all done up with the neck, you know, up real tight to the neck. It does have 35% wool in it. Um, so yeah, but it is smooth and silky to the touch. I'm really loving it and I have it coming to me in olive as well. <laughs> Come on, it's, you know, it's 30 something dollars, it's great. This month, I have used my Coach Tabby 26 so much. I love it. I've been going back and forth between this and the Coach Cassie, sort of back and forth because I've done some traveling and I brought both of these in the travels that I've done. I recently did a video on that. But this one, I have to say, it has held up beautifully. Um, it looks beautiful, it looks gorgeous. I've used it so much. And the best part about it, in a lot of ways, well, not the best part, but you know what I mean, one of the greatest things about it is when you add the gold chain, it is sold separately, but when you add this gold chain, it changes everything. And I have several videos showing the different ways you can do that, and it just makes it a whole different bag. So it turns this bag into a whole other, um, realm of things you can wear it with because it dresses it up so much and I can't even tell you how happy I am with this combination and I uh, did see that this bag is available now in red yes I found it in red There's, it's on pre-order right now I believe I will link it down below so you can find it the C on it is a kind of um I want to say like a reddish and brownish or whatever color almost uh, enameled possibly or I don't know if it's like a something, some sort of resin, I don't know, but it is, it's interesting. It's almost like an animal print in different colors going around, it's very cute. So it does also come in red now, which is fantastic. It comes in black, chalk, and many different combinations of different things with snakeskin and so forth. But I'm telling you, it's a great bag and I love it and it has definitely been a favorite this month. Look at me, holy cow, what is going on? All right, mm, yeah, all right. I'm using my hair screws for any of you. <laughs> Who saw my car chat video and I went to Walgreens to grab some more hair screws? Got them in right now. I just literally threw my hair up and I quickly screwed it in. So that's, yeah, this is a long time later. So I've even been to the gynecologist. <laughs> you needed to know that, didn't you? So anyway, back to my favorites. If you know me at all, you know that I have never passed up a tan, you know, like skin tone for me, tan, beige, whatever colored shoe in every kind, shape, form, season, size, style, whatever. And I recently got a pair of suede heels with a kind of a chunky heel that I wore to LA. I showed them in one of my videos recently that are this like cranberry, Merlot, whatever color, love them. I wore them for an event. I realized how incredibly comfortable that kind of a heel is. Absolutely adore them. And then I saw these, <sighs> my heart sang. Uh, again, a suede heel in a beige, you know, this like a nude color for me. Um, oh my gosh, Sam Edelman shoes are the best, most comfortable, most wonderful. They have a cushioned, you know, a little bit. You could add more if you wish, but there's a little bit of a cushion here. 
it's the heel. Now this one is higher than I normally ever do, <laughs> but I'm telling you, for a heel like this, it is so comfortable. And you just feel steady, you know, you don't feel wobbly. It's ladylike and beautiful and, uh, you know, a little sexy, to be honest. And it's just comfortable. So I just can't say enough. And I love that it's suede. That way it will definitely continue to go into the fall. You can wear this in winter with navies and um, cran. Imagine wearing this in winter with like cranberries and, you know, all sorts of beautiful, deep, rich tones, even with jeans. So, so cute. So I'm loving these, they come in black. And now I'm thinking I might need the black because seriously, a, a black shoe like this? Hmm, yeah, love it. So I'm very happy with those. Next we have this blazer. I got this blazer, I needed a new black one. I needed it in a size that worked better for me. It is the most perfect, just plain. I love that the button is black. It's not, you know, a, any color that's going to stand out or any metallic. The black buttons here, it's just got these little, you know, front pockets like your average one button, you know, regular lapel, lined, lovely blazer. And it's in this knit, almost like a ponty type of a knit, if you know what that is. Um, just so comfortable. So, you know, you're not bound when you try to move your arms. It just feels, it's got some stretch to it. It just feels beautiful on. It's just perfect. I absolutely love it and I'm very excited about it. You can put this with anything dressy and you can also definitely wear it with jeans. Um, you can just wear it as a jacket when you're going out and take it off like it's your jacket and you know what I mean. It's just, You know how to wear a jacket, right? So <laughs> loving it, I just wanted to share that with you. By the way, I need to mention these again too real quick. Again, a beige shoe. These are the Blondos. They are water resistant, you know, they're impermeable. You cannot, not water resistant, they're waterproof. Um, so when you're walking around, when it's supposed to snow in a couple days, I think on Halloween, on <laughs> the 31st, um, so we're going to get slushy, snowy, whatever, and these, you cannot get water through them. Um, very comfortable, very comfortable, cute. I love the stitching detail, very cute. Been loving these all fall, and I know I will love them into the winter when it gets nastier and slushier. I can still wear my cute beige boots. Highly recommend those. Love them. I'm also really loving this sweater. This is one of the ones from that loft haul that I got. Um, yeah, super cute. You might be able to see it here somewhere in one of these pictures I took of, I don't know what, but I'm really enjoying it, sharing that too. Um, okay, these. On a whim, I thought I would try this. I saw this one first. This, it's like a tech hoodie is what they call it. And it is in a very Silky, but not like not like exercise material silky. It's a little more knit than that, but it is a very silky, soft, soft, soft feel to it. Um, kind of a heathered type of a knit. It has the thumb holes, and it has a little bit of this crisscross across the neck and a hood. And it definitely has some kind of what do they call that princess seaming that goes in. So you do have some seaming there. Very um, flattering. It has these pockets. It comes down just, just under the bum, a little tiny bit. Um, I'm loving these. I wear these all the times with my leggings. I'll put my, um, like a tank, and then I'll throw this on over top, and then I can take it off when I start getting hot at Pilates or whatever. And it's absolutely fabulous. I've worn these around the house. They're perfect for loungewear, anything. They're just a fabulous extra layer. Oh, so soft, wash like a dream. And here's the thing, guys, they're $20. So what did I do? <laughs> I got it in blue too, of course. <laughs> they have several colors, um, quite a few colors as a matter of fact, but I also got it in this beautiful blue. So yeah, so happy, 20 bucks. They washed, I've washed and worn the gray one probably eight times and it looks brand new. So highly recommend those, love them, inexpensive, go. Um, <laughs> It's sweater weather, we're bringing out our sweaters. I brought out my sweaters and I have to tell you, I was thinking, wow, some of these look a little worn. You know how you get the pilling, you know, those little balls, you know, that kind of, they usually they show up for me anyway, they show up like right here, under the, I guess, cause that's where your, you know, your arm is rubbing, like under the armpit area and then this front area right here. I don't know what it is about the <laughs> side boob and pills, but that's where, it, that's where they come. So this amazing thing, I spent probably an hour or so yesterday, shaving all my sweaters. 
it's kind of an addictive thing because seriously, I've had these shavers before and they're many times difficult and you know, they kind of clog or they really don't work. You have to go over the same area. This one works very, very well. The reservoir for fuzz is pretty small. Um, so you do have to empty that quite often if you're going to do a whole bunch of things or like the you know, comforters or whatever. Um, but I, I've done upholstery. I had some chairs, like my kitchen chairs are upholstered and where the legs lay, you know, lay, they sometimes get a few of those and it just doesn't look good. And I just shave them right off. It's so simple. And like I say, you want to like walk around your house trying to find things to shave the little balls off of. At least I do. I could go door to door in my neighborhood. I'm thinking of starting a business. I love doing this. So I have done some, I think I have a little clip here to show you about, you know, just to show you one of my sweaters. It just, it, that thing will take the balls off of anything. I'm sorry. Okay, so anyway, I love this. It's fantastic for, um, you know, sweaters, sweater weather it is. And then before you put your sweaters away for the spring, you should reshave them. So you don't have to do it first thing in the fall. <laughs> oh, and my giveaway this month will be one of these shavers. So to enter the giveaway for this adorable little guy, I will get your very own scent straight to you. Um, look at the information down below this video, click on that link, and once you click on that link, it'll take you to Rafflecopter and it'll tell you what to do. And um, I have to usually invent my own um, like question to ask or something for it to go to the next step. So I don't have to make you like, you know, follow me on Twitter or whatever. Those are the other options. So I just do invent your own. So then click where it says invent your own and it'll show the question that I asked. Just answer the question. It's gonna be something, you know, minor, like what's your favorite color? And um, maybe I'll come up with one that's a little better than that. But anyway, that's how you follow through. Make sure you have your email, the correct email that you check on there and click enter and you will be entered. And one week from today, I will draw the winner and the winner will be contacted via email that you put in your uh, entry. So, and then this will be sent out to that winner. Anyway, it's, it's wonderful. It's fun. I love this thing and I kind of want to carry it around with me in my purse and start shaving the, the little ball things off the back of people in line at the grocery store, but I don't think they'll let me. So anyway, sign up for that. I love it. Okay. I am a very, very big reader. I love to read. Absolutely love to read. Um, I don't share a lot of my books often because sometimes they're just either you, know, you just wonder if, if that's, I don't know. I, it, books are so personal to me. I just think they're so, not that I want to keep them personal. Do you know what I mean? Not that I mean that it's private. I mean, they're personal in what you want, you know, what a person looks for in a book. But many times I do share what, I, what I've been reading and this one needed to be shared. This is The Great Alone by Kristen Hanna. I really, really enjoyed this book. It's, you know, it's not tiny, but um, it's very much worth it. And if you're a reader already like me, this will not even phase you. Um, but I know it does phase some people, but it is amazing. I just, it's a, just an epic story. Uh, that's hilarious. I glanced down and the Washington Post said it's an epic story. <laughs> it's an epic story. They're right. Um, and it is a New York Times bestseller. You're sure you've heard of it before. Uh, and if you love Alaska like I do, you will absolutely adore this. So highly recommend that book. So find yourself a good book, stay healthy, and grab this coat as fast as you can because it's like 30 something dollars right now. And let's see, what else can you grab? Anything that you, anything of these favorites you will not be unhappy with because they are great. And don't forget to sign up for the giveaway so you can shave your sweaters. <laughs> it's so much fun. I'm telling you, it is so much fun. Thanks guys, appreciate it. Bye.